Hello gorgeous people and welcome to a new video of top 5 things to do in and this is part 2 of the musical edition. I still have six musicals that I went to in London and they are all in this bag and I'm just gonna pick them at random and just gonna say what I thought about it and at the end I will make a top I think six a top six because there were still six musicals in this bag so as you can see Wicked is already one of them but I will just pick them like right now so here we go Okay, the first musical is Everybody's Talking About Jamie. I loved this musical. I was like on front row, my neck, it hurts because I was always like, but it was such a lovely musical. The, mus the music was amazing. The cast was amazing. Also, um, at the end, they were like at the front of the stage and I was like here and they could just look in your eyes and be like Hi bitch, we're on stage, you're not. <laughs> Dreams! Let's talk about Jamie, worth to watch it in London on West End. Next one. Les Miserables. Miserable. Le Miserable. Le Mis... Le Miserable. So sorry, I could say it. I gotta be honest, guys. I know there will be people that want to kill me right now, but this was my least favorite musical of them all. I'm sorry. Like I said in my previous video, I'm not into history and all those things. And I mean, like, this is all history. And at one point, I even got a bleeding nose because it was so hot in there and I was bored and I thought I was going to fall asleep but I'm sorry but it wasn't my musical also the music it was nice to listen to for me but like for one time I'm not gonna watch it again or listen to it again because yes next one Caroline or Change. Oh my god. This was a musical we went to, uh, me and a friend. And um, it was so random. We were like, okay, it's the last day. What are we going to watch? And we were like, mm, okay, Caroline or Change. It's cheap, so why don't we do it? And um, we went there. I loved it. It was weird at the beginning because I was like, what's going to happen and what is this about? But there was a moon who could sing. There were other things in the room that could sing. It was like so lovely and the music, I loved it. Also the cast, I thought everyone almost was... was black. I just love black people. They are so good at like everything they are good at like singing acting dancing they could do they could do everything like we need more musicals like this okay so caroline or change it's also gonna reach one it's also gonna reach the top next one waitress opening up letting the day will say hello how you been um so <laughs> this was a disappointment i gotta say i knew the music because we did it at school um in song and dance and we were like opening up letting the day in and um I was like, oh my god, it's gonna be amazing. This is the first song of a musical, it's gonna be so great and it's gonna be like a big opening, but I was there and I was like... Where is the rest? Is this everything that's gonna happen? So, it was a disappointment, I gotta be honest. Almost last one. 
School of Rock. I don't know if that's the song of it, probably not. But um, School of Rock was also amazing. I thought this was gonna be like a stupid song, because, a stupid musical, because I was like School of Rock. I don't like rock music, but it was amazing. I loved the cast. It was the children were so little and they were like good at singing, good at dancing, good at playing an instrument. It was like Matilda, the cast from Matilda, but plus one. Plus one, they were so good at what they did. Um, the story was okay, I kind of don't remember what the story was about. I kind of liked it, so this was a nice musical to watch. So if you're in London, don't forget to watch School of Rock! And then the last one, the one we're all been waiting for, probably because it's on the sack, on the bag. Okay, so that was it because it's way too high. So I also, I gotta say, I love this musical. Um, look at, look at this, look at the book. It's amazing. Like, the effects were lovely. The cast was lovely. The music was magical. Like, you were really there. You were really on the stage, you were like, oh, I love this musical. I'm in Oz. I'm here. And I just love it so much. Also the story, it was like, I love that they did a backstory from the witch, from the Wicked Witch. Because now when I see, um, how else is she called? The Wizard of Oz. Now if I see that movie, I will, I'm like, she isn't really bad. She isn't bad. She's just hurt. I would say I would go again, probably, uh, if I have a chance, so, yeah. Now, okay guys, now I'm gonna give you my top six. Number five. This one. Opening up, letting the day in. Then I'm gonna go for School of Rock. Then, on number three. Wicked Defying Gravity Then I'm gonna go for Everybody's Talking About Jamie My number one of this video Caroline or Change Thank you guys for watching and I hope you guys liked this video and I hope you also uh, made IDs for when you go to London and you want to watch a musical that maybe this one could help um, also, don't forget to subscribe and like and leave down below in the comments what you want to see next. Love you. Bye.